what is up everybody welcome back to the channel you guys this right here i'm telling you man we're going through a crazy funky ass time right now um nationwide globally march 2020 um i don't even know what to say about it man it's just a freaky ass time but here's the deal man the strong survive those who are staying on their grind those who are staying focused those who are stay staying positive and those that continue to move the needle forward, those that continue to just kind of push forward, I'm telling you, man, those are the ones that are going to win. And, and, it, and it happens all the time, dude. You think, you think multimillionaires and billionaires only make their money in good times? If you think that, you, you, you completely missed that part in Wealth 101, in Entrepreneurship 101. Like you missed that lesson, right? multimillionaires and billionaires make their fortune when shit hits the fan billionaire uh warren buffett i read an article about him a couple of days ago where what he's doing right now yes he lost billions in the market but what he's also doing is investing billions back in because now he's able to pick up stock and pick up shares at a fraction of what they were just a few months ago. So so don't get it twisted, you guys. In, in, in times of depression, in times of recession, people are still winning. So what you have to do, man, to, to, to the solopreneur, to that entrepreneur out there that has a product or a message or some type of service, here's what you wanna do. Here's the ultimate, ultimate, ultimate strategy, and here's what I'm gonna be implementing. You'll see this. Over the next couple of days, I'll be rolling this out myself as well. I have a couple of different products, and that's why I'm trying to figure out which one. But here's the deal. It's not a pitch. Here's what you want to do. You want to simply come in here to your Facebook ads manager, and you want to click the green button, which will bring you over here. And this is the video you want to be running for the month of uh, – this is the ad you want to be running for the month of April. Okay, April 2020. What I want you to do is I want you to simply pull out your cell phone and introduce yourself, okay? Introduce yourself. Talk about your background, your experience, who the hell you are, your business, your um, passion, your background, everything about what you got going on, everything you're fired up about, and most importantly, what you're offering. It's an intro video. It's not a pitch video, okay? I always recommend this to my clients. I always recommend that this is the very first uh, Facebook ad that they roll out. But I'm opening this up. I'm opening up this, this recommendation for any business and every business out there. It's not a pitch video. It's not something for you to, it's not a video that you're going to sell anything right now. You can for sure. But what I'm saying is that the strategy is to simply introduce yourself. If you're a restaurant owner, introduce yourself. If you're a yoga studio owner, introduce yourself. If you're a local real estate agent, introduce yourself. Whatever the hell you do, Pull out your phone, go on video, and introduce yourself, and simply give empathy, show empathy, and, and, and let people know that you're there for any type of support. Obviously, bring up your business. Obviously, obviously let them know that you're the local realtor or, or, or you're the local dry cleaner owner. Whatever business you're running, let them know that, obviously, right? But it's not a pitch. Again, it's not a pitch. It's, it's, just, it's just that empathy, compassionate intro type of video okay and here's what i want you guys to do you can literally run this for literally a few bucks a day three bucks a day five bucks a day and what you're gonna do i, I would i would run it at five bucks a day five bucks a day for 30 days 150 dollars, you guys ain't shit to do what i'm about to tell you to do okay 150 i want you to go open up your garage and go sell some junk that you have in your garage. Open up your closet and go sell them Jordans. Like you don't need a bunch of crap. Like if, if you have a bunch of stuff in your house, sell some stuff to make this happen, okay? Sell some stuff to open up some type of budget because I'm telling you, man, as, 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 as the world is spinning right now and shit hit the fan, everybody is afraid. I'm running ads right now and I'm getting, I'm getting like, it's, it's costing me less than a penny for some of the ads that I'm running per click per view like it's absolutely ridiculous because no one's in the in, in in no one's playing the game right now everyone has lost their ass and the majority of businesses are not advertising you have those you have those you you have those ones that are that are like me that are saying you know what 
you better, you better, you better, you better get with it and you better keep advertising. You got those ones for sure. And that's why I'm giving you this advice is that you have to be that entrepreneur. You have to be that business owner that doesn't take their foot off the pedal. You might have shut your down. You, you might have shut your doors down, right? You might have closed your, your business. You might be, you know, having a, to, 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 to lay off some employees right now. You might have to, you know, get rid of, get rid of a lot of stuff right now. You might be, you know, freaking um, li, uh, liquidating, right? Liquidating and, and downsizing your operation. But I'm telling you, man, cell phone, simple Facebook video, will go a long ways when it comes to brand recognition and people knowing who the hell you are, okay? Um, <coughs> excuse me. Here's what you wanna do. Five bucks a day and run it for the next 30 days, okay? And Facebook doesn't bill you every day. Like, they're gonna allow you to choose your date and you can, you can, you can like for example with me, my billing date is at the end of the month. So I'll run ads the entire month and I'll run ads for other clients the entire month, and then I don't get a bill until the end, right? So set your, your yours up that way as well, so you don't have to pay it right now. Pay it at the end of the month, but $150, you guys, ain't nothing. Go sell something to make that happen, but here's what you're going to do. You're going to simply pull out your phone. You're going to introduce yourself, and just let the people know what you do. Let them know that you're there for, for, for support. Let them know that, hey, man, you feel for what's going on. Times are crazy and, 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 and people are, are, are losing their asses right now. But at the same time, you're the local business owner and, 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 and you're staying positive and you're staying focused and, and you just want to let, 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 let the audience know that, 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 you're, that you're a message away if they need anything, right? It's that type of message, you guys. And I'm telling you, when you run it the right way, you're going to come into your Facebook ads manager and you're going to run it under video views, Okay. Any other type of Facebook ad that you're capturing leads or making sales, right? You're trying to run Facebook ads to do either leads or sales. That would be a, a, a traffic or a conversion ad, right? To capture leads. But this is not a lead capture ad. This is a video view ad, okay? Now, here's the power of a video view ad. You're going to run it at five bucks a day and you're going to run it for 30 days, okay? And you're going to target your market. You're going to target the demographics. You're going to target that location. You're going to target the interest. You're going to target whoever the hell you're targeting, right? So, so you know, make sure that that's all. And then, and then also, if you're building custom audiences, if you're a little advanced and you, and you have some custom audiences set up, that's who you want to target as well. Maybe people who engaged with your Facebook page or maybe people who engaged with your Instagram profile or maybe people who are on an email list. Maybe you have an email list of customers. You can upload that email list to Facebook and create a custom audience around those people. Um, so if you have custom audiences, that's cool too. But even if you don't, if you just simply target your, your area, whether you're a nationwide business or a local business, you're targeting that area and you're running a video view ad, okay? And all this is, is to, is to get that audience to know who the heck you are. You are running a video ad, okay? Now, every other video would obviously be for lead capture or to make a sell. And that's, that's conversions and traffic, as I mentioned. But this one, strictly video views, you guys. Here's the power with this one. You run it for 30 days, you'll obviously get thousands of people to view it and you'll get a ton of people because again, right now, many businesses have pulled out. Not that many people are advertising, right? Shit hit the fan, budget isn't there. So a lot of that is going on right now, which, which, which allows the cost of Facebook advertising to drop. And, and so you need to take advantage of it. You need to be that bull and be like, dude, I'm going to keep pushing. I'm going to keep going and, and I ain't going to stop. But I'm obviously going to show compassion. I'm obviously going to have empathy for what's going on. You obviously have to have to tweak your message to meet current affairs or current news, I should say, current you know times of what the hell is going on. You have to obviously you know tweak your message to fit that. But again, when you when when you're the local business owner and you're the you're you're the entrepreneur and you come out on, on video like that and you let people know, hey man, I'm here for you. You know, I feel for you. I I I know what's going on. Talk about your business. If you had to lay off some people, talk about that, man, because then people are gonna start looking at you and they're like, damn, dude, I feel sorry for that guy too. And I'm telling you, that right there, that brand recognition, you guys. That, that creates rapport, that creates a bond, that creates credibility, it gives you social proof. And I'm telling you, as, as, your, as your competitors are sitting on the sidelines in, 
you know, and, and I don't say that disrespectfully, as they sit on the sidelines waiting to see what happens, and that's what a lot of people are doing, man. They're just waiting to see what happens. And, 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 and I'm not even going to say that's fine. That's not fine. Like you don't want to wait around to see what happens because you don't know what the hell is going to happen. But at the same time, you're a business owner. You're an entrepreneur. You have to feed your family. So therefore, if we can't exactly make a sell right now, we got to at least get our face out there and at least have our brand out there where people are constantly seeing us. Okay. And if we can tweak our message to fit current times and the current situation of what we're going through, then people are going to really, really, really relate to you even more. So the deal is with this is that you run it five, five bucks a day for 30 days and you run it under video views to target that area. At the end of 30 days, you're gonna literally have thousands of people who viewed that video. That's gonna allow you to run, or that's gonna allow you to, to take those viewers and create custom audiences, okay? Once, once you set that video ad up, you can then go and create a custom audience and Facebook will start collecting all the data of the people who actually viewed it, okay? That right there, you guys, is super, super powerful because then once you end up getting done with that 30-day run, you can run it for 30 days, you can run it for 60 days, whatever. 30 days is, is, is a good amount of time. So during, during this mess, as everybody is glued to their cell phone and everybody's on social media, they're still seeing your face. They're still seeing your brand. And, and because you tweak your message to fit what's going on, they're liking you even more. And so... When you, when you can run that video view ad and create a custom audience around those who watched it, and then once we're done with this mess, let's just, let's just call it a month away, two months away, whatever, you then have a powerful custom audience of thousands of people that you can then retarget with ad number two under conversions, under traffic or conversions, okay? And that's when we're going for lead capture. That's when we're going to make a sell. Now, for those of you that are, that are, that are, you know, you're like, damn, David, I need to make sales right now. Okay, cool. Well then put that same video out and run it under conversions, run it under traffic or conversions, test both of those. And the reason why I say test both of those is because you may not, your pixel may not have a ton of data just yet. If you're brand new at, at, at Facebook ads, your pixel may not have a lot of data. So you may have to run traffic to the, to, to your landing page first so Facebook can start knowing what the hell, what type of traffic you're looking for, right? You got to warm up, warm up that pixel. But for those of you that have a warm pixel, it's conversions all day. You're taking those videos and you're running conversions. Even an image, you're running conversions if you're trying to capture leads and make sales right now. But what I'm saying is just simply kind of maybe back up a little bit. Take a step back, have some empathy for what's going on. But at the same time, still promote your brand. And that's how you're going to do it under video views. That right there is literally the most inexpensive ad. And you'll get thousands of people to see you on a daily basis. Your face, your message, your everything, your brand will be in people's newsfeed every single day. And I'm telling you, man, as most people are glued to their to, to their TV watching the negative ass news all day, they're in a negative mindset all day. So if you can have something more positive, if you can come on and 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 now you're targeting your ideal client and you're and you're and and you're showing compassion and you're showing empathy and you're really showing you know maybe a different side of you where where now these people are relating to you. That's gonna go a long way in the long run, man. That that's gonna that's gonna be that's gonna go a long way, okay? In in the long run, and and I'm telling you, when it comes to your business, branding is everything, and that's that that's one. In fact, that's probably the number one reason why I'm building a YouTube channel. It, it it's social proof. It's branding because you guys are seeing me on video, right? That right there is all the credibility that I need to go sell something else. Right. Like, so when I'm dropping a course or when I'm dropping another product and people are, are looking me up and, and want to know who the hell David is, first of all, they'll, they'll find me on every social media platform. But once they come over here to YouTube and they're like, damn, dude, this guy's talking about marketing. He's talking about social media. He's talking about Facebook advertising. You know, I just got his message or I just saw his ad, you know, a couple weeks ago. This guy must be the real deal. I'm telling you, man, that that's video marketing. Video marketing creates credibility and social proof unlike anything else. And so 
video views, if you're not out there building a YouTube channel, okay, you need to be running video view ads in. You need to get your message across right now. You need to stay in people's mind. You need to, you need to stay top of mind. And again, you need to relate your message to what's going on in today's time, okay? Um, that's video views. You run it five bucks a day. Now, if you have more money, okay, 10 bucks a day and go for 30 days. At a $300 budget, you would literally have tens of thousands of people that viewed that video, which then you can turn around, create a custom audience, and retarget them for traffic and conversions in the future, okay? So that right there, you guys, is what every single business owner needs to be running right now, okay? And if you wanna drop it to just maybe a couple bucks a day, two bucks a day, whatever, do something, man. Do something, $3 a day, $3 a day, 30 days, and run your message, okay? And it's not a message on, some, on, on something crazy random. It's an intro. Introduce yourself because it's, it's as much as you may think that your, 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 your brand is popping and, and you're popular and everybody knows you, I'm here to tell you, I don't mean to burst your bubble, but I'm here to tell you no one knows you. On social media, 99% of the people who follow us don't know us. They live across the country and they don't know you. And that's the bottom line. Like your Instagram followers, they don't know you. <coughs> your Facebook likes, your freaking 700 people that like your Facebook page, 99% don't know you. So don't think that you're Mr. Popular. You're not. So when you can run video views, target your audience, and do that every single week, I'm telling you, man. And in this case, we're going to do it for a 30-day period. We're going to go on a 30-day blitz. You couldn't get that branding effect anywhere else man and it's so crazy like it's it's so crazy like just today alone like just today I swear to god this honest to god truth as my family and i we were driving you know we had a little baby appointment at the doctor's today or whatever my wife is pregnant and we're having a baby you know in in june um coming back from the doctor's appointment we're just driving right and i look at a bus bench right i'm just driving through the streets and neighborhoods and and there's a bus bench right on the corner <laughs> and and it was it was an advertisement of a real estate agent and I'm like, and I show my son, I tell my wife, I'm like, dude, look, that costs so much money. Like these people are still spending money offline, <coughs> excuse me, and, and, and not, not getting anything out of it. Like it, the ROI on offline marketing. Now, some of you guys crush it with, with your offline marketing, but at the same time, you guys are spending a shitload. Don't, don't tell me you're not. You're spending a shitload. If you're getting an ROI or making sales or building your brand with offline marketing, you're spending an arm and three legs. Like you're spending a ton, okay? So I look at this bus, bus bench and I tell my wife and my son, I'm like, dude, these people have no clue. Like that bus bench is not cheap. Like, and, and it, it happened to be a real estate agent. And so I tell my son, I'm like, dude, look, that's a real estate agent. I pitch those people all day to not do that and run Facebook ads. Like I swear to God, you guys, this was today alone. And so it's like, dude, for, for, for what they spent on that bus bench, and it doesn't come with just one bench. You can't just, when you're doing marketing offline like that, you're not just, not just advertising on one single bus bench. Like that shit is a package. Like there's like 20 bus benches that probably came with that package, right? And that's an expensive ass campaign. And so I'm like, dude, for a fraction, that person could have ran an ad, a video view ad on Facebook and had thousands of people in their market see it. And because it was a video and not just some random ass image on a bus bench, that video would have went so much further and they would have had so much more, you know, freaking branding effect across it all. So I'm, I'm telling you guys, man, this is where we have to be. Social media, Facebook advertising, or Instagram, or YouTube. Okay, th those top three, man, that's what you have to master one of them. Master one of them. And, and if you're not going to master it, then obviously you, you know, you're going to go hire someone to go master it. You know, but, but at the end of the day, I'm on a mission in 2020 to teach people how to fish themselves. I don't want to fish for you no more. I don't want to be your marketing guy. No, I'm not going to be your agency guy no more. Like I'm not, I'm not going to be fishing for you. I want to be teaching people how to fish because I truly believe that every single one of you guys, no matter how busy you are in your business, you should be doing this marketing. You should be running these Facebook ads. Now, until you really crack off and you're, and you're, let's, let's call it seven figures. Until you're at seven figures, this part of your marketing should not be delegated. 
you should not have to hire somebody to do this for you if you're under seven figures. You should be doing this shit yourself, okay? And I'm just convinced that everyone can. Everyone can because this is literally a few clicks and the damn ad is live. Like that's not, that's not some, something I need to hire someone for for 2,500 bucks a month. Yeah, right. Like, I'm sorry, man. I'm an agency owner. Shout out to all you agency owners. But it's, it's, it's I'm, I'm going to keep it real. It's damn near overrated. Like, it's overrated, dude. Like, like people try to charge a shitload to do, to do this. And I'm just convinced that you can learn it yourself. A business owner can learn it themselves and, and, and not have to pay 2,500 to some random marketing person, right? To do, to, to click a few buttons for you. Now, is it super, super easy? No, you, there's a learning curve, but at the same time, it's like, dude, you guys could be doing this yourself. Like, I don't care how busy you are. Um, and, and there's just no, there's, there, there's just nothing as effective, man. Everyone and their mother is on their phone. People are glued to their phone. They're scrolling through social media all freaking day. And it's now the opportunity for the entrepreneur to get in front of them and to get in front of them right now while shit hit the fan and the prices are so freaking low to advertise. Okay. So if you ran this ad video views and you ran it for 30 days at that $5 a day or even $3 a day, I'm telling you, dude, you're going to get thousands of people to see it. So rather than some pitch video, again, it's an intro video. Introduce yourself. Let your audience know who the hell you are because I'm here to tell you, no one knows who you are, man. I don't care who, who, you know, you think you're the mayor. You're not the mayor of your town. No one knows you. So get them to know you, man. Run this video ad, get thousands of people to freaking view it. And then, and then, and then build that custom audience to then retarget in the future when times, you know, get a little better. Right. So that's an ad you guys, every single business owner needs to be running. You cannot fully afford to completely shut your doors, man. Some businesses are waving their white flag and they're like, damn, dude, I, I'm done. And, and, and I'm telling you out of, out of, out of my sincere freaking just heart, like from, from the bottom of my heart, I feel for you. Like I feel for you. There's going to be tons of companies. In fact, there's going to be, I don't know if I can call it millions but I'll just say hundreds of thousands. There's going to be hundreds of thousands of businesses, small to medium sized businesses that don't bounce back. There's going to be hundreds of thousands that don't bounce back. And that's a mental thing, man. That's a mental thing. That business owner, I truly feel for them, but at the same time, they're not take, they're not being proactive. They're not, man. They're not. They are not being proactive. Even if they're on their last dime, I get it. But you gotta still, you got you gotta survive, man. You gotta survive. You gotta stay afloat. And you gotta go sell some shit that you may have in your freaking garage to go afford your marketing. Marketing is the most important when it comes to your business, man. You have logistics, you have the operations, you have, you have, you have payroll, you have freaking, you have um all this other random crap that goes on within a company, a legitimate company, right? You have all this other operations and daily tasks that, 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 in, that is involved in an actual company. But I'm here to tell you, the number one most important is your marketing, is your marketing and advertising. If no one knows who the hell you are, no one knows who the hell you are. And if no one knows who the hell you are, ain't no one coming to your business. They ain't buying from you. They're not walking through your front door, even if it was open at this time, because no one knows you. Marketing and advertising is truly the most important when it comes to business. People need to know who the hell you are. And I'm telling you, man, a lot of people are going to tap out. A lot of people aren't going to jump, aren't going to jump on the bandwagon. People are, 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 are thinking that, that, that offline marketing is all they're doing and, and, and that's all they know. And they're not going to evolve and learn anything else. It's like, dude, are you freaking kidding me? Like, dude, you better take what, whatever you were spending offline. It's a fraction to do it on social media. So let's freaking get with it. Run some damn Facebook ads, stay in front of your local audience and don't wave the white flag. This economy needs you. This country needs you. This freaking world needs you. This world evolves around entrepreneurship. So let the people know who you are, man. And, and, and just don't give up, okay? Don't give up. Run this video view ad. Every single business owner out there, that's where you want to be in 2020, especially right now. Um, and that right there will go a long way, you guys. Create that custom audience. And then after that, retarget with traffic and conversions ads. All right, you guys, so get that video done, man, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Over and out.